Sandrines. Yeah, and it was at Sandrines. Sandrines. Uh, <laughs> Except and when you show up and make, all you exactly. do is and talk. That was wonderful. <laughs> With your two Alsatian wines. And it was a crime device <laughs> Alsatian launch. And we were sitting next to each other and chatting for the course of it. And as soon as we finished, I swear Teresa like grabbed my hand. She's like, come with me. And I'm like, what are we doing? And she's like, we're going to Cardulo's. So we're looking at the ridiculous markups and laughing at them. And I was like, oh my god, I love this moment. And it was just so fun, and we went through because I feel like I don't know. There's sort of issues in Boston with people not bonding and bringing people together, and everyone's so separate. And that was the first time I realized, like, wow. First of all, you're amazing and so much fun, and you just make people happy to be around you. But also, like, you have this amazing ability to sort of bring disparate people together in this business, which is far too rare. And you leaving. Be so sad, and I hope that we can all still pull together without you here. But no, we're never honestly, out again. Yeah. it will never. <laughs> it will never be the same. That's what I said too. <laughs> it will never be the same without your energy and enthusiasm and just all around general. I mean, if you're here, you're here. Yeah. 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 No, 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 absolutely. Yeah. Teresa, I think at the end of the last. Uh, dinner, as you know, we all had a fair amount of wine. I might have mentioned something about the fact that I was very intimidated as a salesman uh, coming to, to sort of uh, sell the wine. Whatever. And you know, I, I was sort of like, you know, staying off, just kind of like, well, wine speak for themselves. That, that's my, <laughs> my thing. But the, the fact is, I was so eager to impress you because I, I because I, you just you sort of the model of class for, for what this industry is all about. So it, it, it's just like, Something you can't really put into words. <laughs> Cry! Yes! 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 He did it! He did it! Yes! 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 <laughs> that is a high five. Now, 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 Mike, you, you can admit it. Fuck you, Mike. You can admit it. You didn't mean any of it. He didn't mean any of it. It was all an act. <laughs> you did it. Just so you know, just so you know, Mike just won the pot of $200. Yeah. Much. All right, let, let's let Mike speak. No, thank you so much for <laughs> helping me along in my journey and helping us all along. So I wish you the best of luck. You don't need an ounce of it because you're going to fucking rule New York. <laughs> Uh, I have less eloquent things to say. I really say that to Mike. Just make her um, cry more. Man. Yeah, I mean, I, I do. I, I think that thinking back to the first time I met Teresa was also, it was at the wine shop. It was in the wine bodega. And it was one of my first times alone in the wine shop with all these weird wines that I've now embraced. And, you know, Teresa came to pay a visit that Kevin had told me you'd be paying. And uh, you're picking up a nice magnum of, of Schloss. Um, and I thought it was great. And um, we, we had a brief moment of, like, hello and this and that. And I didn't know who you were, and, and here I am, and you're absolutely one of my mentors in, in the industry. Oh my God. And um, cry, bitch. I mean, <laughs> so in any case, we are here to present you with a um, ironic T-shirt from the wine. Yeah. 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 We're, we're, in, we're in great health, and um, teach all the schools a lesson. Uh, uh, Thank you so much. Thank you. And now I was going to say is I just remember I have an account of way back when, and it must have been, and Andy Carton, you were involved in this, when Teresa and Andy, I invited them over to my place in Arlington. And it, how many years ago was that? Four years? Three years ago? A couple, a couple years ago, I was there. A couple there. years ago? Yeah. So, and Andy brought over a, like a whole load of things, and uh, it was really exciting to be um, there at that moment when Teresa sort of this idea was born and she took it and and really put it into something and she created this whole structure for this platform this wine tasting uh, event which I've been very happy to be a part of it's been fantastic and, and Teresa also I think and I've probably said this a few times uh, is, is the nicest person I've ever met in the, in the wine industry. Come on, dude. Oh, I am. Really, really. really. <laughs> On Thursday. Yeah. Uh, she, no, she's so kind. Uh, you know, really, genuinely, she's so sincere, and I think that's what I, I love about. And honest, you know, absolutely. Like those and, 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 I get a deduct point. You know. So, you're not supposed to. That's all I wanted to say. Teresa. 
that I love my wife is that she is super picky and she went on a trip and came back raving about this girl that I barely knew and I'm very happy to have gotten to know you over the years and I'm very thankful to you for putting up with all of my um, beating you over the head about how <laughs> wines with sweetness belong at the table and I would like to thank you for having of the two winemaker dinners that I've been a part of both of them have been here, and both of them have been huge successes, and both of those winemakers still rave about the food and you. And we love one more for And yes, I think uh, we can definitely have it in the Thank you, Eric. Get up close to Martin. Martin. It's my turn. Martin! Okay. Martin! Martin! Actually, no, we're not going to talk about the game. What? We're going to talk about the first thing that Teresa said to me. At least in my head, anyway. Um, she might have said things about me before this. I'm not privy to that information. But, um, the first thing I remember you said. Don't talk and take this. Shut up. It's not going on YouTube. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. <laughs> the first comment I think you making you made to me. That really stuck with me. I forget the, the the situation in itself, but but we were talking about a particular wine, something maybe a little obscure, a little off the beaten track. And you said you said to me with complete self assurance, I can sell anything. <laughs> and we're go this is like five years ago, and that was like that to me just really resonated. And and. I, I think confidence, obviously, in a person is a great thing, and whatever your endeavor is, whatever you do, confidence is, 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 is obviously beneficial. And the and confidence that you do a good job in the, what you do with the people around you, that's a wonderful thing, but, but the confidence to, to inspire other people to do good in what they do around you. Is a whole different ball game, and I, I I feel like you've done that. You've done that in this restaurant, and you've done that in this room, and uh, I think it's pretty fucking awesome. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck yeah. And, uh, well, yeah. Pretty goddamn sure you're gonna do it in New York too. Yep. We're gonna try. So thank you. But thank if you, you don't, your, you can come back here. <laughs> And, and uh, good wine, and good, good business, and good I like that one. Teresa was uh, one of the first people I met in this business, in this, in this area when I first moved here. And she and I have grown to be very good friends, um, very good confidants, very good uh, drinking partners. More importantly, and uh, and we've shared a lot of that, and, and uh, th there's no one that I've learned uh, more about uh, about the the whole environment that that we are all in, uh, other other than Teresa, and I'm gonna miss her dearly. Unfortunately, I'm gonna see her way too much in New York because I'm I am there often. Uh, unfortunately for. For, for her probably more more than me but, um, unfortunately also I, I, I have a feeling these these dinners are gonna fall apart because she's not going to be here she is the glue that that, that, uh, that puts this all together and and, uh, and, and and gets this excellent group of people together and do all this and, and we have so much fun and uh, I'm just trying to figure out a way to make her cry <laughs> uh, <laughs> not working. But no, it's not gonna. We're all gonna cry. But but in in the same respect, uh, um, it, it's it's been a wonder to to be with all of you guys, and and Teresa's a huge part of that. And, and unfortunately, like I said, I think 
uh, that, 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 that's, that's going to be lost without, without her here. And, uh, Could you commit to coming um, up like once every three months? <laughs> yeah, like yeah, we do. No, no, no. No, no, no. I was, I was, I was about to suggest dinner and you suggest all of that. No, no. We're all getting on Megabus and we're fucking going down there. Yeah, exactly. That's what we're doing. We're going to do with you But I, I, I do have to say that, 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 that these dinners and, and, and all of what, what, uh, you know, all, all of what we do here is, it, 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 I, I, I think there's definitely something special about about uh, the group of people in Boston, whether it's you know at the restaurant level, retail level, uh, distributor level, uh, clown level, clown level, whatever it is. Uh, the, 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 there's something about Teresa that really brings us all together, and and, and it's and, and and we should all feel really fortunate about that. I I definitely do. Um, and. Uh, I don't know. I mean, I think we should all uh, be happy for for Teresa and where she's going next, and and for what she's done for us here. So. Out of place, and then Teresa said the exact I go to thing every that you feel out wanted of place, to huh? say, <laughs> and then you felt in place, which oh, is yeah. the like. Like, what the fuck are you here. talking about? This is Chardonnay, and why does it taste like it's it's supposed to be Coro tea or some crazy <laughs> shit? And, and Teresa is the first person to say that, and you're like, yeah. exactly what she said, yeah. which, which is a great thing. Are you talking about the, the like lack of filter? No, no, no. Oh. I'm thinking about because she's she's got she's got a place. You know, everybody who is in this business wants a place. They want a place where they can. You know, hang their hat. And Teresa has this place. And so when you know Martin comes up, and I can talk to Martin and go like, "What the fuck are you talking about? Arula game? What is that? This is stupid." You don't know. And then, and Martin can say, "You know, this is this is this will work for you." And Teresa's already done it. You know, and and then you go, "Oh my God, I am so far behind the ball." Yeah, that's it.